Hey, howdy. Mojave D here. I'm doing well. I hope you're doing well. Let's check on Arthur. Let's see if he's doing well. Uh, today, um, I want to fish a little bit. We're going to start off fishing because uh, it does give a bonus to um, uh, health and uh, what's the other? Uh, and, and honor. So we're just going to fish for a little bit, real short. And then I want to go check out the Greys and see what they're all about. And I don't know what after that. Oh, Molly. Molly's in camp. And she's yellow, so we need to do that. So let's get my big head out of here. And let's see how Arthur is doing. <laughs> all right. Um... I have to turn this light off, man. Lighten up my face. Um, you don't need to see my face. You do not need to see my face. Just disappear it completely. Um, we should be in camp. Um, I believe it was Kieran wanted to go fishing. I hope he still does. Uh, because the camp was low on food. So I figured, okay, we'll go do some fishing and get some food and then go check out the greys and then molly and then who knows man this game is so beautiful i i know it's all in black and white but it's still beautiful and they put me way over yonder what did they put me way over here for um, I was in my tent. Um, the fishing is gone. Well, I might just go fishing anyway. Health supplies are flashing. Here's Molly and the Greys. The Greys aren't. Oh, yeah, the Greys are way over there. That's not far, though. It's just on the other side of town. So, um, camp funds are strong. They're, they're fine, man. They don't need any more money. And I want to see if uh, Kieran comes back up with the fishing. Um, Biddy, he? he didn't come up. Ah, oh, man, he was there. Now, why is this flashing? Why is the, the health supply? Why are the health supplies flashing? I don't know. Let's find out. Um. Well, it's right in front of me. What is the problem here? Why is this flashing? Um, I mean, I can take... St oh, there's, there he is. Is that Javier or Kieran that wants to go fishing? I see it. Um, I don't know if Chow is ready yet. Uh, what time of day is it? You have a dog? Hey, boy. Who has a dog? I never heard of that kind of dog. Hey, boy. <laughs> Girl walks past him and he says, hey, boy. Um, let's see who wants to fish. Um, well, let's see. I don't think Chow's ready. I think um, he slept just until morning. And... Um, for being foolish. It was an old thing, and my emotions got the better of me. Thank you. Dutch? Hi. You boys are my family Howdy now. How do you do, Arthur? Boy, I did it. Damn, Bill. You know, I don't like your attitude. Well, okay, then. What's up, Micah? You're welcome. How much thanking does one man need? You owe me. All right, well, I should be getting on. Okay. That was pleasant. Um, ciao. Uh oh. You okay, Uncle? Yeah, I'm gonna do some sniffing around, see if I can drum up some leads. 
Well, do it quietly. Yeah, it's not ready. Um. Oh wait, it's cooking. Or, all right, let's go. Uh, where is he with the, the fish? The fish, the fish, it was there. Did it disappear again? No, it's there. Is that Javier? I thought it was Kieran. Fishing. The rivers around here, famous for the smallmouth bass. Fella I met showed me a couple spots. You want to join me? Uh, I can't fish with you. You're far too good. Oh, come on, come on. Hey, join me. I'll show you a couple of my tricks. There's a spot not too far from here that I've been wanting to try out. Glad you're so excited about this. You will be too when you start pulling out smallmouth. Oh, I've got to change the spelling on her name. The fish should be hungry for their dinner. I thought you said it wasn't far. Too far to walk, though. Yeah, come on. Ha! Been a while since we rode out just you and me. Probably since we went looking for John on the mountain. Uh, yeah. Already seems long ago. How you feeling about everything? Been a strange couple of months. Hey, you know, I can't even return to my country because the price on my head is so big. This, this is nothing exactly new to me. And I'll always be loyal to Dutch. He sees the world the same as I do. If we have to fight, we fight. If we have to run, we'll run. If we must die, we'll die, but we'll stay free. And Dutch, you... You don't feel like, well... That he's doing things a little differently now? You saw what happened with that girl on the ferry. No fight, good or bad, is one without blood. I know that better than most. I think too many people are focusing on Dutch when they should be looking at themselves. What they could have done better. Uh, maybe you're right. Um, what happened to the girl on the ferry? I don't remember a girl on a ferry. Whoa! We'll cut through to the right here. The other day, I rode down to the Lanahatchee River. I caught some beautiful steelhead trout. You mean the Lanahatchee River? No, 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 no. The, the Lanahatchee. It runs right near here. Yeah, but it's pronounced Lanahatchee. Why is everything in English said differently than it's written? Make us feel stupid? Oh, you're asking the wrong feather. <laughs> we are passing okay, up a lot of hill. game. Oh, look at this. Oh, this just, this looks just like uh, a place I know. Arthur! Okay, look out, come on. Here. Let's go try our luck. Oh, man, I, I you know, this, I have fished Pretty a place country. just like this. <sighs> Beautiful. I have. Come on, let's go I, see what's um, hiding. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. They're jumping. You take this spot, Arthur. I'm going to cast from over to the right there, so we're not in each other's way. I don't have a fishing pole. Oh, items. Oh, I, man, I'm telling you what. 
I've been here. I have. Oh, wait a minute. Um, b b b b uh, no, bait. Uh, uh, let's get the right bait. Um, that's a bobber. He says there's uh, bass, rock bass, and bluegill. So that's the only thing I have for bass is this cheese. Fast. Time of day really can make a difference. Oh, definitely. They feed early morning or late evening because that's when the insects are more likely to be out. Did I have the wrong We're bait. Lucky. Got such nice weather, but rain can be good. Sometimes big fish think the raindrops are insects. Uh, nothing's happening. Did well, you? I guess it's still relaxing, even if I don't catch anything. Oh, I'm not supposed to catch anything. Sort of like... Deputy Sheriff. Staring at the sky. It's your bait, I think. Come use some of mine. Oh, it's not the bait. It's me. I've always been a poor fisherman. Especially compared with you and Jose. Just try some of my Here. Okay. Crickets. Crickets, perfect. Thanks. Um, uh, um, so do I have, do I have crickets now? It looks like I still have cheese. Oh, there we go. He's a fighter. Trick is... Let him tire himself out. It's not letting me do anything. Um, can I cast, please? Okay, let's try for another. I was thinking... You remember that stagecoach we held up in Nevada? Yeah. It was a tip from that crooked lawman in Reno. We open the door and it's full of women and children. Rich, but women and children. So we let it go and read in the newspaper that the O'Driscolls robbed and killed them all the next day further down the trail. Yep. You know, way back in the day, Homo O'Driscoll and Dutch were... Sort of friends. Friends? Well, not friends, really? but they had an understanding. Then Combs Main Street got meaner and Dutch. Dutch nothing. wanted to try to live a different way. And now, here we are. Another one. <laughs> I'm going to tangle up his line here. I'm getting blanked? Look at that. That's a good looking fish. Well done. I heard people talk about a huge smallmouth in Lake Oangela, west of Strawberry, over in Big Valley. You need a lure to catch one that big, though. Well, I have a lure. Make a nice meal. Five pounds, twelve ounces. That's not bad. Oh, keeping you. It's getting close to nightfall. Fish will stop feeding soon. Uh, I, I need to put more bait on it. Come 
more and then head back. My bag is getting Makes cold. sense. You say he's heading back? Another one. There's one coming to it. Hit it. Hit it. Let me get out of your way. Pull to the left as he goes right. Another one. Good job, Arthur. That's a little one. Five pounds, nine ounces. I'm still keeping it. Not bad, you see? It's... It ain't just the bait. I'm gonna head back. You wanna join me or uh, you keep trying for these bastards? I'll head back with him. I'll come. Okay, let's go. I guess I don't need to be following him. Is that it? Yeah, I've got to change the spelling on her name. There he is. Why are you wearing that badge around here? I don't know. I don't know. Um, uh, Chuck Wagon? Let me tell you, that's for nothing. Not happy at all. <laughs> Don't know why. Well, that's not true. I do know why. They're lazy, good-for-nothing brats. Every last one of them. They're whores with ideas miles above their station. I mean, in my day... This stew is decidedly lacking on decent meat, Mr. Morgan. I'd have been horse-whipped. And I was. Hopefully, oh, I was horse-whipped. And I'm grateful. Oh, I wish Dutch had let me whip some of them pathetic wretches into shape. I want to use all my they fish. They need it. Oh, so help me God. They need it. I mean, it's bad now, but it's only going to get worse. It's ridiculous. It's not ridiculous. I mean, there's simply yeah, no respect that pot for their better. Completely empty. Good job, Mr. Morgan. Um, I want to get rid of that hide. This is using crafting. Um, I have a hide on me. I have a hide. There it is. Sure. Might as well make some money off it. Thank you, Arthur. All right. And I think... We'll do Molly, but I think we'll do the Greys. What do the Greys want? Just need to go and see what we can find out about them. We didn't do a whole lot of fishing. I might just go fish on my own and, and see how that goes. Um, but I guess right now, I, well, dinner is is over. Oh, here it is. Well, and we cannot access it. We can pour coffee. And um, let's go see what the gray is all about. I might just go do some hunting. Well, we got Molly.
why isn't his health all the way up? Why has he got a little nick on his health? He's got a little bit of a nick on his health. I don't know what that's all about. Um, no food. I mean, they're too early or too late. Apparently. But. Oh, there is a fire. Hey, Lenny. Hi there. You've been doing good. Thanks, Arthur. Um, there is a fire where we can cook our own. Oh, what's going on here? Ladies. We did well. Tilly's asleep. <laughs> They're both asleep. That was a fun job. We made a little bit of money. Nobody got hurt. And we just had ourselves a fun time. <laughs> Let me tell you something, kid. You want a job done well? You take this fella along. I'm Is that so? I'm gonna sleep and mm -hmm. uh, carry on. Is that the fire over there? I think where I can cook something. Quiet. Look at this. A quiet, peaceful camp. Is this where I can cook? Yeah, this is where I can cook. Can I not? Um, um, do I have a recipe? I need to get some uh, some greens. I need some herbs. Let's cook this. I want to stow some uh, in case we get into a fight. the Mauser. Why does it always change my weapons? We'll cook this and stow it. time we camp. Um, my place is by the pier over here. My place is right there. We gonna take a little nap. Tell me some stories about when you was young and pretty before time ravaged you. Oh my god. You horrible man. <laughs> That's right. But he was beaten just the same. Mm. I ain't gonna play. Alright, let's get some rest and let us go see the Greys. Let's rest until noon. I'll be right back at you at noon. All right, let's uh, let's take a look at our weapons before we do, we do this. Um, oh, I can't in camp. 
new bones. I can't in camp. Uh, he could use a shave. Um, there we go. Now, um, I want to check my guns. What else we got? In we got fishing again. Let's go, well, let's go fishing. I'd rather do that than go scout the grays. Let's see what this one is. This is Kieran. This is Kieran. I thought was who we were gonna go with. Arthur, you going fishing? Yes. We're running off to Como Driscoll. Of course not. <laughs> I was joking. That's very funny. <laughs> yes, very, very funny. I saved your life, and now you torture me. Ho, ho. Shut up. Do you want to go fishing with me? I, I found an interesting spot. We'll do well. I'm not a great fisherman. But I am. <laughs> I'll teach you something. We come? Sure. All right. We can... All right, then. Grab your horse and let's go. We can bond with uh, Kieran a little bit here. He did save my life. Okay, girl. Okay, follow me. I know a great little fishing spot along the beach. Uh, let me change my weapon as soon as I can. And I can't. All right, girl. Who'd have thought it? Wasn't that long ago I was tied to the back of your horse while begging for mercy. Now we're all fishing together. Yeah. How do you know I ain't just looking for a good place to drown you? Because I saved your life, Arthur. Uh, you keep saying that. But I save your life every day I don't kill you. Uh -huh. So we are more than even on that front. Come on, All you right. don't mean... Hold on. Uh, yeah, I don't want this here. Cattleman's Flacco. That? I want Flacco. You believe him. I'm good with Granger. Um... Let's do the 22, just in case we have um, some varmints we might need. And let's get the trusty Lancaster out. Now where's this spot? Uh, not much further. I was going to maintenance them. I wanted to check. We haven't been doing that much shooting, though. It should be okay. This is the place. Some beautiful smallmouth here. Bass? Sure. This strip of shore looks perfect. Pick a spot. Well, I'll pick the yellow spots over here. me there, huh? Seeing lots of bluegill and bass over here. Bait with worms or crickets if you got them. Otherwise, maybe some bread or cheese. I, I could have sworn I'd, I'd picked this. Um... Said cheese. You get many bites there, old Driscoll. I ain't an old Driscoll. I told you fellers a hundred times. I'd only been with them a couple of months. I was just a runner, helping out with the horses mainly. Bottom rung of the ladder. And to think that was the high point of your career. Home goes through men like cigars. Let's change. They ain't like you folks. You barely knew my name. I'm more Kieran Vanderlyn than Kieran O'Driscoll at this point. Honest to God. Mostly I'm I'm Kieran Duffy. I hate to break it to you. But I ain't sure Karen Vanderlint is gonna stick. <laughs> Got one. There you go. Nice. 
I don't think so. I don't think it's all that great. A little bluegill? What do we got? A rock bass, 11 ounces. Let's throw it back. Now see if you can hook another. Um, LB. Oh, oh my, no bait. Crap. Giving up on me already? No. I ain't giving up on you. What do I have? Corn? Man, I've used marshmallows. So, you think Dutch trusts me now? <laughs> That's a good one. What? Not in the slightest, my friend. I can't win. I promised loyalty, he says, but you wasn't loyal to Cole. If I say I ain't got no allegiance to nobody, he says... Oh, let's change. Cheese for rock bass. That's for river fishing. All right, we'll try the worms. Well, I know you won't turn on us, then. I don't know what you want to hear. I'm trying hard to feel sorry for you, but somehow I... I just can't manage to. What in the world? Arthur, are you seeing this? The feather's naked as a jaybird. Is that why you like this spot? My lord. Hey, There's watch the line! Hey, I nearly gulped down a minnow. Sorry, fellas. Didn't see you there. Why don't you take a break? Come on in. The water's wonderful. You hear we hope some to. Fishing? You haven't scared them all away, have you? Oh, just so you fellas know, there's some real big ones over that way, like this. I can't do anything else with Well, I better keep the blood pumping. Hope you gents catch something. Yeah? Maybe we'll take a look. Thanks. I know where that is. Well, come on, let's go. Come on, let's go. Hey, wait up! Are you coming then? Yeah, I'm coming. Come on, girl. Okay, girl. Um. We didn't have much of a chance to interact with that, uh. Skinny Dipper. I, I think this is the place that naked feller was talking about. Yeah. Did you see that amazing bluegill? Yeah. Sure. That got you real excited, huh? Come on, Arthur, let's walk down to the beach. Hope we land this monster. Uh-huh. It ain't easy to catch a fish like that with bread and cheese, but uh, you never know. We might get lucky. Guess we'll see. What are you waiting for? I'm picking bulrush. What's wrong? That, that big fish didn't scare you off, did it? Legendary. We found a legendary spot. Closer to me here. Get after that bluegill, Arthur. Um, bluegill. I don't have bait for bluegill. Looks like the best I can do is worms. I said, worms. Do I already have it on? I guess I do. So who taught you how to fish? My pappy, mostly. I, I lost my mammy and pappy when I was young to cholera. 
Your mammy? Like I said, I was real young. After that, I was on my own pretty much, but I knew horses and fishing. Well, uh, just think now you'll never be alone again. Did you hook him, the big one? I don't know. Yeah, no. Don't feel like much of a fighter. Nope, not Oh my one. gosh! Let's keep Pickle. trying. Yeah, 15 ounce. Throw it back. Look at these right here. Um, but I, I don't have bait. Bullhead, catfish, chain pickerel. Um, let's try the crickets. Look at them right here. You can hit them with a stick. See? Look at this. I ain't so bad. At least you ain't tied to a tree. I'm still a prisoner, Arthur. I can't step outside camp by myself for a second without being terrified of one of Combs boys is gonna come pick me up. When I'm in camp, I got Bill and Sadie whispering in my ear all the time how they're gonna kill me in my sleep. It's like living in a nightmare. Christ. If I'd known you were gonna moan this much, I'd have never have said yes to this. You got it! That has got to be the one, right? No, it don't feel very big to me. No, that's not it. No. I will keep it. I, I don't think I have the right bait to catch this thing. Worm didn't do any good. I don't think we have much chance. We need better bait. You uh, might want to see if the stores around here sell anything better. Okay. I think I'm going to head back to camp, Arthur, if that's okay. Yeah. Sure. Go on. I'll see you later. Yeah, I'm, I, uh, we need better bait. No, I'm done. How do, how do I end it? That's how. Okay. Well, that was not all that exciting. Man, I was, I, no, 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 no. How do I ended it? I, I'm, 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 how do I end it? I unlocked the survivalist cha challenge. I don't know what that means. I need to change the spelling on her name and get it right. All right, let's go. Uh, let's go set a course for Granger. Let's or Gray. Gray. Let's get this out of the way. Weapons are forbidden. All right. So it's just gonna be a uh, meet and greet kind of situation where we're just like I'm looking for more greenery. Well, we've got animals all over the place. I don't need any of these for the uh, satchels. Oh shit! You can't be here. Get the hell out of my sight. You don't 
Like visitors, huh? Why don't you go in peace? This here is oh, your... Okay, okay, I really am done now. Well, how can I get in there if they're gonna treat me like that? <laughs> He's aiming at me. Um... change course and try to come in from the other side we can hit the general store and maybe get some bait yep I'm not sure why he didn't want me in there well that was a Braithwaite wasn't it and um want the grays. So the Braithwaite's definitely don't like us. Um, yeah. but they don't like me, I should say. Huh. 78 degrees, it's a warm day. There's that bank, that bank keeps calling to us, doesn't it? I got some horse sense. We gonna bushwhack a proper convoy. These dirt poor nicks ain't got spot. Now what you think? It ain't been this slow in a long time. Stop right where you are. You best finish your business in town. You'll have to ask me nicer than that. Not for this. Hey, come on now. I can fight better than this. Come on. I thought I could fight better than this. What happens if I loot him? Do 
Do I get in trouble? Ma'am? You must know how unwelcome you are here. Hello there. Sir. Hello, mister. Hello. Wanted some food. There we go. Whoa. A woolen mill. I'm looking at the gunsmith. Let's see if we can um, take care of our guns in here. Sure, if I'd see you again. What can I offer you? So apparently, Archibald McGregor put down another moonshine steal the Braithwaite's had out of the swamps. They're shameless, that family. Does not need to be cleaned. So I've already done this. Okay. Um, we have been using this a bunch. All right, we've got it clean. I think all our other weapons are fine. I think, well, the Springfield might need some, some work. Actually, no, it was in good shape, too. Buddy. What's over here? Hey, that area is for me only. Why? Don't need that kind of behavior in here. Just check in. You deep in your cups, huh? A whole bunch of... So they made him food for the buzzards. Hey, folks, 
Evening. Ship and get some help. Been a while since you were last here. Ship and get Have a up. look. All for sale, except the floorboards. Now, let's have a look. Do they have bait? Um, these arrows. You can't go wrong here, unless you own the place. Sold out of a lot of stuff. The things the ladies of Rhodes say to each other when they're browsing these huh? shelves, <laughs> like they forget I exist. Huh. Well, you're out of everything I want. Never mind. And there was me with my hopes up. Well, you don't have anything, dude. How's your friend getting on with those new If you fancy doing some shopping, come on back. I mean, really, that, on, that was unbelievable. Evening. Oi. A nicer motel than that. Um, we haven't stayed at this one actually. Violence in Valentine. Read all about it. Hey, fellers. Evening. Evening. Is it locked? I thought it said it was a hotel. I thought it said it was a hotel. Did it not say hotel? Well, okay. Evening. A very good evening to you, sir. How's it going with you? Not my best day, dear. Crazy. Um, there, there's a, oh, I can't. Here. Um, there was a decent hotel in here somewhere. Get up. Hey, out of the way. I'm on a tight schedule. I'm looking for my friend. Gavin. Gavin? Gavin. Uh, where the hell are you? this guy? Who's this over here? Is this a house? Can I knock on the door?
Hello, sir. I can't believe you would show your face back here. Howdy. First time? Yeah. There's a bar. Restaurant. Y'all in here too. Hey, mister. Well, we out there now. Settle down, fellas. Loonies. Sunday Gentlemen, Sunday partner. Hi, right, please. Oh. Hello, mister. Now get. Oh, there ain't no cause no more. Don't oh. pretend otherwise. Ma'am. A ammonia rider. Quite an answer. Very well indeed. Move along. We ain't looking for your company. What's up? Oh, we can play cards. I was just looking for a place to sleep. We'll we'll do this. We'll do it. Bye. I'm not interested right now. I swear they had a hotel. Let's go, cool, girl. Sure. Gunsmith. Heck. So that, um, Lemonia, lemonade raider, rider, didn't want to get, whoa, 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 I think I see a snake. Uh, didn't uh, want to get in a fist fight. Interesting. I thought I saw a snake over here. Yeah, good girl. Yep. We gonna be able to get in here? Yep. Okay, so do I be nice, do I antagonize? I gotta be nice, right? I, I gotta be nice. What do you want, boy? This here the Gray Plantation? Yep, Gallagher Hall. Sheriff's orders. You wanted me to have a word with some folk on the property. I'm recently deputized, you see. Deputized? And I suppose Lee was drunk when he did it? Look, you can come in, but you ain't talking with me. Obliged. Ha-ha! <laughs> My horse is following. I just talk to people. Hey, uh, I was hoping you'd talk a moment. I'm a student of the history of the region, and uh, I ain't the one to speak to. Try Master Bo. Think he's down there by the wood store. Boy's got all the time in the world. Master Bo. 
I'm probably shouldn't crash through the hedges. I'll see you at the sheriff's office. Excuse me, friend. We friends? Not yet, but he is hoping. I guess. We don't get a lot of traveling men here, and suddenly Two there's a horse of phalanx of mysterious but strangely helpful Yankees about the place. Is there? What are you doing here? I was just looking for work. Well, looking for something. Don't worry, your secret's safe with me. What secret? I got a secret of my own. Are you secretly normal? Excuse me? Never mind. <laughs> the thing is, I don't care if you kill the whole lot of us and the Braithwaites. I don't want to kill anyone. I love her, you know. Love who? Penelope. But it's impossible. Well, love tends to be complicated. She's a Braithwaite. I'm Bo Gray, son of Tavis Gray, Julia. nephew of Lee Gray, the sheriff, grandson of old Murdo Gray. We Greys have been loyal to the state and murderers to the Braithwaites for so long now, no one can even quite explain why. Beyond blind loyalty and stupidity, I'm supposed to be loyal to some nonsense while she... She's amazing. She's like a woman from the future. She's like tomorrow, if tomorrow turns out fine. Well, okay, I'm Romeo. sorry for your predicament. Would you help? I don't want to get involved in <laughs> gang feuds. It seems unseemly. I'll pay. I've got money. We Greys, we've always got money. No brains mind but money. Well, in that case... I know she loves to sit out in the gazebo on the edge of the Braithwaite property. Take her this letter and this bracelet, please. Okay, Romeo. Oh, look out for their guards. They're worse for strangers than ours are. Sneak around the grounds. So long. Of the great weight manner. Yeah, they they don't like me. The Braith Weights. If you do sneak me, around. I shall not forget it. Sneak into the grounds. Have to sneak into the grounds. Those boys want to kill me. Giving me a yellow brick road, you cannot use weapons, I know. But can they? You're acting as a deputy for Sheriff of, for Sheriff Gray. I cannot use weapons. How am I gonna sneak in? have a few. And we've got some star-crossed lovers. Well, I'll stay on the yellow brick road, but I gotta sneak in. Uh, 
Um, these guys are not uh, friendly to me. I am a deputy for Sheriff Gray. I get it. Here we go. Howdy. Yeah, you're all right, girl. Well, so I'm not on their property yet. All right. She'll stay on her own. Cannot use weapons. And she's by a gazebo. Sneak past the guards to Penelope. the music. Guards. Um, I, I assume I'm going to see guards. I don't even see any. There's one. Off to the right. Straight ahead is another one. them. Yeah, there you go. To move. Penelope girl, I hope you appreciate this. Are you Penelope Braithwaite? Well, yes, I am. I've got a letter for you. Oh. And a gift. <laughs> a letter and a gift. Well, we don't even know uh -huh. each other. <laughs> well, it's not from me. It's from, uh... From Bo. <gasps> oh, Bo was the name of my dog. He's so... Strange? Well, yes, he's a little strange, but also so human. The rest of our families are stuck in the Dark Ages, or... Well, I don't know, cave people, perhaps. Bo's different. But if they find out, 
They'll kill him and send me to live someplace awful, like Ohio. Ohio? Have you ever been to Ohio, sir? Yes, I have. Well, neither have I, but my uncle has a factory there. He was sort of the black sheep on account of having left. But now they tolerate him because he's a vicious snob. Families are, are, there's something else. Hmm. You got a family, sir? No, not really. Well, they tolerate him because of the money. But me, with my ideas above my station, they can't stand. That sounds pretty complicated. I, I don't know quite what to say. Well, nothing to say, except I hope they all rot. Oh, gosh. I don't. Uh, well, maybe a bit. But here. If you see Bo again, will you Bo. give this to him? Sure. <gasps> I've had... Now what do I have to... It's all red! Hold on. I've had several dogs in my life. The best one was Bo. He was a Brittany Spaniel. Uh, field trained retriever. And um, it's spelled just like that. B-E-A-U. Um... I will um, be right back. Oh man, you know, we're just helping out star-crossed lovers here. Ain't that sweet? It's so sweet. Forbidden love. Have you ever? I have. <laughs> I have. Um, I'm never gonna tell you about it either. All right. Um, we're, everything is red and my horse is a hundred miles away. Um, and we got to get out of here. Oh, how we do, how am I going to get out of here? How do I get out of here, guys? Leave area without being seen. Without being seen. Seriously. Uh, <laughs> wow. Um, so if I get spotted, it's mission failed. Is that is that right? How uh, that works? So I'm just looking for um, guards. Come on, girl. Go, girl. We did it. That was so easy. Um, the Course of True Love. Bo Gray asks Arthur to deliver a letter to Penelope Braithwaite at Braithwaite Manor. Complete within three minutes. Well, you know... Next time. Uh, are we done? Wait a second. I have to get back to Bo, do I? I have to get back to Bo? To deliver that letter? Well, he's a gray. I mean, so that's easy. But if I, he's yellow, so if I go over there, it's going to kick off something else. It said it's complete. Um... So what I'm gonna do, because my plan was to uh, to to deal, do mo with Molly, do Molly, you know what I mean. Um, let's camp and fast travel back to camp. We can cook. Let's cook some gritty fish. And fast travel back to Clements Point. Mm. Could I have fast traveled to Gray's Mansion? I, di I didn't look, it was too quick. Well, that was really easy. Um, I imagine this advances the story somehow. 
what was important, it was yellow. I don't want to finish, I didn't want to go back to bow. Maybe I should have gone to bow. I just have it in my head to do Molly because she's been talking to me. And um, we just never. Hey, Arthur. Can, can I have a quick word? Yeah, she's been doing this for like the last two episodes. Yes, Miss O'Shea. Ah, call me Molly, would you? Arthur, how is Dutch? I mean, how does he seem to you? I'm about the same as usual, I guess. I, I really love him, you know. But if he... Green eyes. Like he always says, loyalty is everything, so... Arthur! Excuse me, Miss O'Shea. What you want? I bring a gift. The great gift of information. So you got some tip-off, so now... I can risk my neck and make you some money while you're Molly. You, you know, Arthur, Molly. Is, it, it works on the inside as well as on your sour face. If you say so. But you could go find some other fool to run your errands. Bill, come on over here. Will you be my other fool? You too, Charles. What are you talking about? Arthur's above a little stick-up I heard about. No, I'm not. You just said. Hey, I'll do it. As long as you ride with us. Well, I got a serious medical condition. Yes, you are a compulsive liar. No need to be like that. Charles, have I ever lied to you? I hardly know you. Exactly. Now, you uh, should do this. Charles. It's easy, and I'll only take a small commission for my information. But it's now or never. Then it's never. Molly! Oh, God help me. What happened to Molly? Look, Molly is definitely agitated and very concerned Uh, and we don't, we don't go anywhere with it. Um, okay, let's continue. Man, I'll do it. <laughs> well, what is it? It's a supply wagon. Oh, my gosh, one, a robbery. Very briefly unguarded, apparently. As it passes through a crossroads near here where there's an old ruined church before it connects with the rest of the wagon train. Very easy picking. As long as we get paid or... Okay, you we're get shooting. Shot. I'm happy. You are a sick man, Arthur Morgan. A very sick man indeed. So this way, bunch of smart Alex. Yeah. How you get wind of this old man? We only been down here all five minutes. Well, while well, you boys been off fishing or playing lawman or whatever the hell you've been doing, I've been getting down to business. <laughs> Found in the nearest grog house. Hey, you don't want in on this, Williamson. That's fine by me. Do us all a favor. Head home. Just give it a rest, you two. Just have a little faith for once, will you? I've been scoping jobs like this since you fellers were knee high to a grasshopper. Once a decade, maybe. So what is it you scoped here exactly? Well, I told you. There's a wagon with a lockbox passes through every week. Right here. Okay, hold up here. We should cover our faces. Oh, they'll be passing. Um, items. Through the crossroads up ahead. When? Soon, Williamson. Christ sakes. I should be due any time now. Let's keep this quiet and clean. Nobody needs to die here. Hold on. There. You see, just... Um, that clockwork. <laughs> stop the wagon! I said, stop the damn wagon! Whoa! Now, don't try anything stupid, and we won't do anything unkind. You know, boys, I. I don't, I don't want to get shot, but this is a mistake. I work for Cornwall Kerosene and Tar, Mr. Leviticus Cornwall. Leviticus. Oh, 
So you know him? <laughs> he doesn't. I hear he's rich enough to share the wealth around and not miss it too much. Oh, he'll miss it. Okay. Why don't you check out around the back? Arthur, help me out here. Are you gonna give me a hand here? I am. Now, let's see what's inside. <clears throat> okay, we're looking good. Must be nearly a thousand here. Whoa! Shit! Hey! Think I see something! Uh huh. Let's go, Arthur! Let's go! Yeah! Until dark, and then we'll sneak out of here. Okay. So I'll keep watch for now. Sure. Well, we uh, get some rest. Okay. Yeah. Um. Break. Uh, smoke them if you got them. I need a. I need a. Uh, I need a break. Hell. Oh man, I, I don't know. What's um what's the plan here? Um we just uh, we're hiding uh, um Where are we? Okay. <laughs> oh boy. Uh, well, I'm not going to see anything here. I need to, um, have my radar up. We're sleeping. All right. Let's get out of here. Let's try and get out of here. Hey, oh, shit. <laughs> Absolutely. Well, shut up, old man. Look, I was just trying to... Shut up. There's a light. Uh oh, oh gosh. 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 Darn it. Hey, yeah, here we go. Let's just keep this calm. See what happens. Well, I can tell you what's gonna happen. Is this your place? Kinda. Uh, and you didn't hear nothing? I, 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 why don't you just tell me, partner, what you heard? Go ahead, go ahead. Tell me what you heard. I don't, uh, maybe I, I heard some noises out by the barn a while ago. Oh, you bum. Ain't me. It better not be. Troop fourth, low. Go check out the guard number two. Check guard number one. So guard number two sent guard number one. Well, they're both coming. Um, we, oh, we 
got to do this quiet. If we can take these two out quiet and then skedaddle, hey, no? Well, the place looks deserted enough. It is. Beat sure. it. Sure. You head inside. I'll Ain't go around. Ain't nobody here but us chickens. Buck, buck, buck. Just chickens. Uh oh. What am I supposed to do here? Place looks empty to me. The old guy up there is full of crap. Get down. I don't think they're Get here. Get down. Don't see any horses. That's Come right. On, let's head back. Bubs! Place is empty! That's Shit. right. Oh no! What the hell? Looks like we're shooting our way out of here, fellas. Yeah, it does. Watch it, Charles. We got more of the bastards on this side. Where are they all coming from? Looks like Mr. Cornwall's going up to security. More on the right here. Where? Oh, I, mean, I didn't even get the right to shoot. Out of the way. I can't mark it. Just hope we don't run out of bullets. My God. Nicely done, Bill. You think you got move in the army too? Hey, if you keep shoot your that guy? Feet still for ten goddamn seconds. You got us into this. Checkpoint. Where are they going to put me? Oh. How many of them are there? Um, I guess we look at the X's. More on the right here. Back to here. We got more of the bastards on this side. This fella really ah. don't like getting raw. 
Out of this? Quick. Behind these rocks. Behind these rocks? Dude, uh, I okay, hold on. Geez. They're coming this way. Perfect. Um, I need to heal, boys. Um Out of ammo? It's over, 
Oh, my shit, my own guy. Who am I shooting at? I'm gonna leave you cold. God damn it. I didn't know I was shooting at. Some money, didn't we? Sure, but now we got corn on our back. It was an honest mistake. Hey, leave it, Gwon. Get out of here. Every man split up, Gwon. Run quick. Good luck, Jens. Stay quiet. Whoa, ho, ho, man. Total take nine hundred. Gang four fifty. Your share twelve hundred. Eleven hundred. About one hundred and twelve bucks. Um, where's my horse? Man, they had a lot of people. Um, Matt, um, what's the objective here? Um, Lenny, uh, um, um, do I dare stick around and loot these guys? Dumb. Investigating, that's yeah, dumb. Okay, we're out. Idiot. That was dumb. Hey, you're okay, girl. There, girl. What's that hand all about with a diamond? Oh, that's a game. Ah, uh, um, <laughs> once again, my my brain waves are clogged, jammed. Whoa, whoa. Ah, uh, um. Uh, so we still don't know what's up with Molly. I can't believe I'm talking about Molly. We just about got our uh, brains blown out. 
uh, that's it. That's it for the video. Um, uh, uh, man, uh, thank you all for watching. I do appreciate it. Uh, forgive me for not having my, uh, my, my brain gets gets completely um, jammed up uh, when that kind of stuff happens. Um, wow. Uh, take care of yourselves. We'll see you on the next one. I don't have any words right now. See you next time.